50 years to life in prison. That was the sentence handed down Tuesday for Medford woman Patricia McCollum for the murder of her husband, Chris. Justice is less important than uh, the death of my son, of course. And, uh, you know, justice being served does not bring him back. Mike McCollum's nightmare began in November of 2012. That's when investigators discovered his son's body at the bottom of a steep cliff deep in the Applegate Recreation Area. He had been shot multiple times. A jury found Chris's wife, Patricia, guilty of murder the following year after a two-week trial. The star witness, her former stepsister, Amber Lubers, who testified that she and Patricia plotted together to murder Chris during a camping trip. That testimony, along with texts detailing the couple's marital troubles, were key in the defense's case. I think we all felt that we had uh, achieved closure a year ago when she was sentenced, when she was um, convicted. Both Patricia and Chris's family were in court Tuesday. Chris's father and other family members read letters to the courtroom and their former daughter-in-law. As Mike read his letter, he asked the judge for a life sentence for Patricia. I went in saying, this is what me and my family recommend. Mike tells us he and his family are taking it day by day. And as time continues to pass, he says he's more at peace now than he's been through this entire nightmare.